Welcome back to more Wildermyth. Make sure to uh, follow me on twitch.tv slash onion siege and you can watch this stuff live every weekday at 9 p.m. Eastern. And as always, you know, if you're enjoying this, please remember to leave me a like and a comment so I know you're having a good time. No, we are plumb in the middle of the chapter, actually. All right, what do we got here? <sighs> Is anyone doing stuff? Nobody's doing stuff. It looks like this whole side right here is is kind of kind of not happening right now. So we're gonna start this mountain ridge. And we're gonna build a pass. And let's get everybody who's closest to do this. So you three go down there, and then the rest of you go over here. Why is it always the mages that are the ones that are Saying like, I guess we could we could carve a path through this mountain, because that's gonna that's gonna take a hot stanky minute. So let's send you there, you there, you there, and you here. Okay. Now this is a bit of a risky maneuver, but I think it'll work out okay. Yeah, you guys, not gonna happen. That's a big no. That's a big old no for me, dog. All right, that's the defenses. That's the defenses. Okay. So I need Black Crow Blues to go over here. And I need Sailadol to go over here. All right, cool. Now it is time for a patrol. And we should be able to clear this stuff out before the naughtiness happens. Oh, there's not even a bridge there. Okay. So, hmm. Because we're gonna we're gonna be in for a fight here. We're gonna be in for a fight here at that. Let's have you two start heading over this way. We can ice these cats. No problem. No problem. The rest of Philnona Meadows spouted long shadows when clattering deepest sacked Leaf Delve. How will the crows of the glorious fall and set things right? Glad I didn't eat. Let's see. We have a 90, 91% chance of charging in successfully. So let's do that. Charge broken up by the train is... Oh, huh. 91%, huh? Cool. Oh dear. Alright, well. Oh, you are... What, is that thing gone? No, it's right there. Okay. Let's take a quick look at everyone's character sheets. Got a stone crossbow, we got a leaf spear, got a leaf doohickey. Alright, lightspeed champion. Let's, let's get you talking to this guy, please. Yeah, a water bow. Sure, that makes sense. Oh, whoop, uh, a bit crowded here. Let's actually silk step just to not be in the middle of the fight. No, what if I pet him? No, he'll he won't die. God damn it! Bring. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is fine. This is okay. As long as he doesn't dodge it just like that. Immediately. Just, just. There we go. Oh gosh, I hope he's not too close to Lightspeed Champion. There you go. No minimum range, baby. Now we're talking. Oh no, close that door. Move here, let's interfuse here. And then I guess the best course of action is to fire leash. Never mind. Fire leash and set black row blues on fire. Like, cool, yeah. 
What is the mushrocks? This whole thing. Pew. So this whole thing is being cute. Yeah, fair. What's your deal, man? Let me just give you a little smooch. I can I can offer no smooch. Okay, what do we got here? Looks like nothing else. Yeah, that's a regular fire now. So, whatever's on the other side of this door is gonna be big and scary. Whoops, so big and scary in fact that I ended my turn early. There we go, okay, let's actually open the door this time. Well, you aren't big and scary at all. Are you, uh, what are you made out of? Bones? Yeah, bones will work. Bones, I can deal with. Ugh. Buck. You have to be kidding me. Whee! Alright, now walk. Walk into the Guardian, please. So I can wrap this up. Oh, shoot. Didn't realize that would refund an action point. There's a birds. Enjoy yourself, sisters. The buffet's back that way. They'll be doing the line yandering lands a favor. At least you can't be all emeralds and sisters, I guess. Mind you don't pick up any fucking diseases. Eight days remaining. Okay, shit. I'm just gonna have to have I'm just gonna have to hope the the patrol ends before the incursion kicks off. Oh, and it takes eight days to fix that too, huh? No way. Alright, that's donezo. I guess I'm just gonna have to send everybody over here. Uh actually no they don't. Ugh. Forget that. Alright, that needs a river crossing, aka a bridge. So let's get everyone. No, no! There. Let's get everyone over there. Stoke your bellies and gird your blades. And smile, tomorrow there will be deepest to scrape off our boots. How do you think Twisted is settling in? Uh, uh, what are you? Uh, that's quite a blaze in that one for sure. Why, what do you think? Oh, I agree with you. Uh... Yeah, let's do romance. <laughs> you thought you were an adventurer, but actually you're infrastructure planning and maintenance. Nobody else is fucking doing it. Somebody like Twisted reminds you of blood in your veins, you know? How could you not fall for that? And Billy's like, hey, and Twisted's like, um... I'm supposed to get some more firewood. I could use the company, or your leg. Don't run off and start a new life together. We still have all the job to do. Twisted and fat have fallen in love. Oh, Shaggy, I'm so proud of you. Father Fungus. I'm in this picture and I don't like it. Oh boy, all right, you are just right out in front, aren't you? Can I get a discus off of this bad boy or no? Yeah, all right, I can get a, I can get a cheeky shot off with the rock here. I don't know what Father Fungus is all about, and I'm scared to find out. Oh no, spores! Oh no, he's healing! Stop doing that! No! Get out of here, Father Fungus. With your healing and such. I can't sell asleep, can I? If I attack twice, then that's really not any benefit, so I'll just do it from over here. And then fire with Billy's shoulder. Billy only is the only one with good posture. I mean, the kid's got a 14-foot vertical. Can't believe they have more than one Chosen. What's the point of calling him Chosen, then? You can choose one more than one thing. You can have jelly beans and gummy worms. Hmm. 
Billy. See what Fat did? See how he hit the guy? You should try doing that. Wow, you see how Twisted absolutely mulched that dude? Should I do that? Oh, he's mad. Uh, I don't have another melee fighter to capitalize on that. And it doesn't matter because he's dead anyway. Why use tactics when I can instead just crush them with a mace? The deepest are all dead! Battles led them down a blunderous roam where the gray grass matches the cloud color. Someone doing dragon pictures? Hey, Twisted. Old Twisted Sister, the magic lady. Badly hurt? Hmm? So what's your favorite monster? Oh, definitely the tenfold gorilla! <laughs> Busting big lizards. Always less partial to that one. Gotta be a classic, like the giant, a race of monstrous folks, different from us, and yet not entirely, the essence of monstrosity lies in the twisting of human ideal. Those are answers fine, but some of us will always love a dragon. And <laughs> uh, <laughs> she's just like, what happened to loving me? What the hell? There'll never be something as monumentally awesome as a fire-breathing dragon. I could definitely see myself riding one. It'd be black, or maybe red. Can't wait until we're around a fire. The story is well sore. So it's always kind of awkward where you're like, I don't really know what I could be doing right now. Wild folk hid and all of the story bog was unsettled when Clamoring Deepest sacked Otterdor. How will the cause of the glorious hole and set things right? Hurts to see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Charge in. Sure, whatever. 91% chance. Hey, we did it. Failed last time, succeeded this time. Thereby making it a 50% chance, Captain XCOM Math. Got another Father Fungus, another Mush Rocks. Everything else looks pretty manageable. Okay, let me get light speed up. Yeah. I just need her to be out of the way. Because this Mushrox is going to come in hell-bent for leather. Wow! Through the hearth! That was really impressive. What the hell was that thing? Well, it doesn't matter now. He's dead. Yes, keep walking into the meat grinder. Those warm children are adorable little gremlins. Uh, I guess we're focusing fire on the mush rocks because I can't quite get an eyeball on that chosen. Okay, hopefully we can put the mush rocks in the ground, ice these two horn children, these two children of the horn. Um, and then get ready for the Guardian when he comes up. Beast. Yeah, I need you to walk into this Guardian, please. That's fire. That's fire again. There you go, thank you. Fo focus, focus! All right. You like them apples? A couple of timber cutters haul their logs towards the market in Southern Stride. Or, well, Kessie the Cow does most of the hauling. Yeah, Kessie! Big Kessie stand. Unless they're toxic, it makes an otherwise delicious animal mostly inedible. Yeah, you just gotta. It's like when you prepare a fugu fish, you just have to cut out all the rocks around, the toxic rocks. Feel free to ride for a bit. You girl's strong. Aren't you, Kessie? Don't talk to the. She eats like she's strong anyway. Go on, hop up there. That's what I need. Is, is, this is what I need is a resin stain in the worst possible place. They roll through the rest of the day. To the feet of the mountain. Bring up here, hon. The clover's thick. I think she can smell it. Oh. Oh, on second thought. That's a dried up old skull. You're not offended, are you, girl? Afternoon, travelers. Headed to town? That your wood down the hill? Sure, I'm assuming this is my wife, San. This is our cow, and that's what Winter gave us down there in the cart. 
Good time for lumber. So this ride's growing. As for us, we're... We know you are. Black Crow Blues and Slippery Lightspeed Champion. If you've seen the back, we wouldn't have dared this road, but now, truly, really are lady. It's anything you need. That evening. Slippery doesn't feel like a compliment, does it? Caw, 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 caw. Here, let me roast your bird for you. I can skin, get skin nice and crispy. I know, I know, I know how to cook birds real good, because I'm a bird. After a great deal of toil, Autodor is mostly standing out. The townsfolk have suffered, but they're used to rebuilding. This is why you have to look out for yourself. Uh, that same thing again. They really loaded us up. This guy got the rotten parts off, with, like, like with apples. Yeah, well. And be very careful. 13 years of peace and two cards out of the deck. Oh, that raccoon scared me. Pat never tired of rallying up tavern patrons, challenging the arm arm wrestling matches and seeing looks on their faces when they realize arm. Oh, okay, that's why. Sailor and Lightspeed enjoyed talking about the old days over a campfire. Sailor would always exaggerate how many monsters he had slain in each battle, but Lightspeed didn't feel the need to correct him. He's like, I was there. Plant wealth and watch it grow. An old man took black. She, so she planted coins alongside of scattering healthy seeds. Trees swung up, but their leaves were green, not cold. What were you thinking? Billy finally translated Wardion, the haggard secret notes on the aerodynamics of axe head shapes. Because apparently he had nothing better to do with his time. Twisted added a new addition onto her house. She put a sturdy table in the center of it. It was always found excuse to have friends for dinner. Lightspeed watched the children of Pig Bottom grow to adulthood. She gave them a kind ear when they brought her youthful troubles. Uh, a poison in a line, damn. But that completely prevents him from being an archer anymore, so we're going to say no. Okay, froze another tile. Um, uh, I'm going to go with no on that one, too, because then she'd have to swap to crossbow. Blinding it on stunt. That's really good. 10 to 12 damage, one tread. Jesus Christ. I don't know if I'll have to get rid of her spear, but uh, I'm taking this one. Um, <laughs> me leg on fire. It's a pretty place, I'll say that. Lightspeed well, dips her jug to fill uh, in the rocky spring. And since she's not alone. Oh, you're quiet. Please, this way. Off he goes. What if I just turn around? The hillman follows a fern-dressed footpath that climbs the cliffside up to a humming forest overhead. Lightspeed traces the steps, wary and wondering what's waiting at the top. What she finds is not what she imagined. What is it? It's a skull! Many weeks later. We're lucky you made it back to us. I'm not sure lucky's the right word. I thought I was careful. At least I kept my composure. Oh. Oh, fuck. Don't be alarmed, said lover. Don't raise your weapon. It's a forceful way to deliver an invitation. Exactly. Hard to believe. Begin negotiations under threat. An invitation to where? A parley in a neutral place of our choosing. You've been kicking our teeth in for the past 30 years, and we figured we might as well give it a shot. Nope. We don't suppose we can arrange our own alternative? We don't even know what to ask. And exactly how do we get out of this? Knowing what I mean. What terms are we even discussing here? What she said to me. We've held back, given you time. But the peace you're so desperate to keep, it does not befit us. Well, fuck you then. We will shatter it. Spurn us in our ranks. We'll rise to swallow every rain softened township that's ever sheltered you. Piggy. Sounds like a bluff. Could be. Not sure myself. We will await your arrival. Just know that the peace will not last if you fail to honor our request. What peace? Sure, the deepest have been quiet, but there's always word of new things creeping around out there. The wilds aren't safe. I had to say it. I don't think we have much time. Not if we can't what happens and the people are relying on us. Please. My father didn't survive the last upheaval, and I have no right to ask you, but please don't let this happen again. We'll keep our eyes open, focus on the immediate stuff, build, defend, then we talk, when we're ready. And when the trap closes, who in the world will save us? That's what I'd like to know. Of course they fucking do. 
Parlay with the deep ones. Where are the deep ones? Why hasn't the map gotten any bigger? Oh shit, they're way up there. Okay. Okay. Everybody's back where they live, I guess. Pig Bottom, Lonely Sham, and then the rest of the party living in Starry Bog. Or sorry, Otter Door. Hey, everybody go over there, and then you two go find out who this new person is. What are you talking about? Black Crow Blues is a youthful 66 years old. Never mind. Uh, when are you leaving? Oh, shit. Uh, soon. There you go. All right, good Charlotte. The demons are more widespread than we thought. We're handling it, but barely. Well, we're lucky we have good. No one can inspire our patrol groups with good speech like she can. She keeps us at our best. And it's easy to find a good words to say about that crew. But you heard what Lightspeed said. I would think about this a lot. From the sound of it, I could be doing this way more for us long term in a company like theirs. Sunderstride doesn't mean much surrounded by a world full of deepest. What? Leave? But who's going to keep us from losing heart? Frey really could do a decent job. She's got enough heart for the whole town. This is the right thing to do. I can't turn down the opportunity to fight. Guy Lauren is not having it. I'll come back and visit, I promise. We can't let Fraley's head get too big when he's gone, right? Warrior! Raw! I've always wanted an excuse to comb through West Forest. Best relic hunting in the lands I've heard. Sounds right up your alleys. Except for the monsters, I assume. That's the thing. I've been known silence since we got here. None of the debris, none of those noises at night. Uh, maybe we lucked out this time. I mean, too, too much to hope for a few days vacation, bro. The sword Night Shard is supposed to be around here somewhere, and that would be fantastic. Uh... Night Shard? I'm afraid we're going home with that. There are markets in no places that pay high prices for something like this, and where... <laughs> I'm sorry! <laughs> Professional. <laughs> Finlaw. Oh shit. Okay, that was not that was not my intention. Black Crow Blues is actually a thing. <laughs> I just didn't expect the one in ten million chance for <laughs> this specific sequence of events to happen. Well <laughs> see that. Do you know him? Ah, huh, does she? Former colleagues, let's say. Wait, have you what have you doing with people like it's not important. Shut up. Oh, but it might be to your friends here. I assume you folks are okay with having a traitor in your group. That was a long time ago. I don't betray people anymore. Believe me, my brother knows as well as you do. He's still in prison. I have a choice. You always have a choice. Hey. Excuse me, I don't know who you are. Black and the rest of us are the crows of the glorious fallen. She's the fucking crow in the title, dumbass. Are you not paying attention? Until now, we've only been fighting monsters, but you want to change that. Be my guest. Uh... So you can kind of hero now, huh? Sure. You're in it for the spoils, just as much as you ever were. Just a more convenient excuse this time. You want me to set him on fire? Actually, that's kind of a good deal. I don't really need a sword, but another able body would be good. Look, I know you got around. Can't miss the dangers it's been building in the Yandarin Lands. It's not the wait for the face to head on to play part in the story. You always have a choice. Plus, you went wrong. The spoils are pretty good. Wait, you're serious? You betray me. You take my brother from me, and then you come trotting up years later telling me to join you? Damn it, you know what? If anyone wants to join the trader, go right ahead. Walk over there. Melora? Black seems to be doing quite well. I don't want to wait around to end up in prison like two. Two traders taking care of him one day. Not so bad after all. Wait, listen. Take the sword. Take the sword. Alora leaves with us. Nobody gets hurt. Wait, really? You can't even use swords. What are you talking about? Well then, look at Black giving up something shiny. No wonder you became a hero. I'd say it suits you. You'd probably take that as a compliment. 
They're gone. Phew, two more seconds I might have started on the real insult. Right? At least we'll have a lot to talk about when I get back out of here. Well, we got an archer. Who is 70. And well past retirement age. What were you doing, Melora? By that I mean Fiona Apple. <sighs> well, that was certainly a wild ride. Oh shit, she is a grandma. I can't get away with this voice. In the deep caverns beneath River Caught Ironworks. Bailey, keep up. Sorry, I don't like it here. I feel as if cold, the cold these rocks permeates my very soul. Besides, the torches are on the front. It's hard to see where I'm. Wah! There he goes. Ow. What? Where? Wow. What is that? Oh, shit. Uh, ooh. How long has this been down here? An extraordinary stone, surrounded by ordinary rock. Hmm, it's jammed in there pretty tight. And I believe this is, uh, if he pulls this out, he gets the crystalline mutation. If I can just get my knife in under there. Hmm. Something's wrong. What's mmm? Arg! Mmm! It rammed it right into his eyeball. Billy, there you are. What did you- <gasps> What happened to your face? I don't- I don't know. There's a gem in this statue. It seemed wrong somehow to leave it there. Well, whatever happened, the dwarf must have heard that scream. Pour him up. They'll be all over us. Oh, it's lizard boys. There was a deepest shrine, and the gem says how the will is communicated from below. Well, that's going to make, uh, it's going to make Billy Talent really important for the next three weeks before he fucking retires. All right, Twisted Sister, go after him. Give me the fire rod, baby. Go, go, go. Oh, God, no. Don't do anything silly, Fire Spirit. Ow. No! Do oh, a tier two fire staff. Yes, please. Thank you. Um. Sure. <laughs> Thanks for the new staff, Fire Spirit. Bonk. Man, that was close. Thanks for blowing our cover. It's not my most articulate moment. So, now what? I don't know, it feels cold, I guess, but it seems like normal. I guess I learned to live with it. Who knows, maybe it'll turn out to be a blessing in disguise. Just try to keep up next time, okay? Stop falling down pits. You, I know you love falling down pits, but stop doing it. Bird noises. Bird noise I get. I wonder if they'd obey me. As if you don't have enough on your plate. Now the crows need your attention too. <laughs> it's it's trying to communicate. That one seems to have a lot to say. Can you make any, any of it? Almost. Uh, shining, sh shiny. Shiny, probably. Figures, if a crow has one word, it's shiny. So either get a benefit or get an item. Let's go with the item. Crow gurgles and hops forward then flies off. Rawr! The whole group seems rather riled up. Any discussion among crows is lively. I've met whole families like that. When the crow returns... A coin! Fascinating. Better than the things we get from most humans. Yeah, we haven't been paid for any of our jobs, actually. Is that any kind of recognizable? Nobody would accept this as currency. This may be as useless to me as it is to you, friend. Thank you, though. It is nice. Crows bobble amongst themselves. They then unfurl into the sky, leaving the crows of the glorious fallen once again in the silence that looms before battle. It's like a weird through fare of, of coins here. I mean, yeah, I was... Oh, okay. Hang on. I'm being told to put this somewhere. On somebody who stick around. So, good Charlotte it is. Flex is like, here's this weird thing. You take care of it, kiddo. Is that gonna work? Yeah, they just shoot through the part of the wall that isn't there, I suppose. Anybody in here? Significantly, yes. What have I got? 
What I could use is a legacy point. Thanks, boss. Run free, Spirit of the Wild. Get over oh there. Oh, I have to actually, I have to open the door. <laughs> Why can't I go through this wall? Okay, hopefully it's something nice. Then open up a cupboard over there. No. Nah. Cover just serves as a means for me to uh, use environmental like damage and stuff. <laughs> oh no! Let's let's just get kind of everybody sort of in this general area, and then we'll decide how I want to do this. Here's a bunch of crap. <laughs> oh, that is, that is chunky. There you go, Jory. He's like, I know how to use a crossbow. Scout this, patrol this. Get that shit out of there. Yeah, and then we'll, we'll scout and sweep back and clear everything. Oh shit, it is actually, it's actually the end of the episode. So while these are running down the clock, um, I will go ahead and say uh, thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this episode of uh, Monarchs Under the Mountain. Uh, if you did, please do remember to follow me on Twitch and subscribe to me on YouTube with that bell for more videos like this every single weekday. You can find information about this game in the description below this video. You can find me on social media. At the CJ Andrew on Twitter and Mastodon, Facebook.com slash S15 Studios, S 15 studiosio where you can find all the stuff. Uh, you can find my tabletop games, including um, Nightmare Theater and Small Stories. Uh, and you can find everything else I make, including articles and short stories, such as A Softer Wall and The Lord of Vermin, at S 15 studiosquarespacecom Once more, hope you've been enjoying this, and I'll see you next time.